The subject of this blog post regards the timing by Romer of the eclipse of Io as it passed behind Jupiter in its orbit. I'm going to animate this scene and you'll see Io approaching in front of Jupiter. You'll even see the shadow across the face of Jupiter. And what I, Romer was trying to do was start the clock at the moment when Io eclipsed right at that time. And then he would continue running the clock. It should take approximately 42.456 hours normally for Io to make one complete orbit and be in position once again to be eclipsed. So that was the challenge that Romer faced, is try to get these times as exactly as possible.